Hi, today I'm going to hook up my Wireless Pro PWM or Pulse Width Modulation Speed Controller to my previously modified trolling motor, which you can see on a different tutorial. And this is going to be a cable remote speed controller that comes with the unit that you mount somewhere inside your kayak. And that's waterproof, and so is the controller as well. So as you can see here on this modified trolling motor, I've got the standard four wires that are showing once you remove the head. You've got your white and your yellow, which are your forward and reverse directions. And then you've got your black and red, which are positive and negative power to the trolling motor. And what I'm going to do is hook up the controller and show you how it works. This is a close-up of the handheld controller and the sending unit. You can see the gray wire coming out of there from the handheld controller and the gray wire going into the sending unit. And then the first black wire here is going to be connected to the negative of the trolling motor. The first red is going to be connected to the positive of the trolling motor. This black is going to be connected to the negative of the battery and then this red is going to be connected to the positive of the battery. So that's how simple this setup is. And normally the installation tells you to go ahead and hook up the plus and minus of the sending unit to the plus and minus that come out of the stock head unit that's on the trolling motor. Now because I removed that, I just went ahead and hooked up my positive and negative coming out of the trolling motor to the sending unit. Now that's okay because when they tell you to hook it up to the control head, they advise you to turn it to the number five setting. And the reason they tell you to do that is because that allows the maximum current to flow into the trolling motor. But since I've removed the head and I've taken out that switch as well, it's okay just to go ahead and hook up directly to the plus and minus of the trolling motor. And I did talk to the owner of the company and advised them of the way I wanted to do it, and he said that was fine. Okay, so now you've seen how everything is connected, and it's kind of simple. I'm going to go ahead and do a test with it. So I've got my controller box here. On, off, reverse, forward, and there's the trolling motor prop. So we're going to go forward. And you see it spinning forward. I'm going to take it all the way to off. Now I'm going to go in reverse. And it spins in the reverse direction. So it's pretty simple. If you have any questions, just go ahead and leave them for me in the comments. Thank you.